Hey, we're now out in the field and under this water surface here one of the largest migration of earth on earth is taking place just as we speak. It's the deal vertical migration of soil plankton. The traditional way of studying this is to use one of these samplers. This gives you a very good picture of the, the population and the community but it doesn't give you any information about the behavior at the individual level. So today we will show you a method developed here at Lund University of how to label these small organisms to be able to track them at the individual level. We have now moved into the lab where we will label these daphnias. For doing this we will use fluorescent nanoparticles called quantum dots and we will use a, uh, one of them that's fluorescent and 655 nanometers, so red, and one at 585 nanometers, which is yellow. So the next step is now to add the uh, polylysine coated nanoparticles to the daphnias. So now we let the daphnia incubate in the quantum dot solution for uh, one hour. Now we uh, rinse the uh, excess quantum dots off the uh, daphnia and then we move into the other lab where we have the experimental setup where we can visualize the, the labeled animals. And now we're going to transfer the labeled uh, Daphnia into the uh, aquarium. So now we're recording a video here where we can um, see the behavior of the Daphnias, how they swim around, and also distinguish between our, our two different, uh, different colors. So now when we have uh, labeled our Daphnia and uh, made our uh, videos of the swimming behavior of them, we can uh, track them and actually follow their behavior and all different parameters like speed, position, and then we can make these nice plots where we can follow different individuals. For this example here we had one Daphnia labeled yellow and one labeled red, and then we can plot their trajectories and actually follow these in, uh, at the individual level and see how, how the speed varies, for example, uh, when we expose them to um, UV, as done here in this experiment, and we can follow their uh, reaction. After developing this uh, protocol, we will use this full 3D system and the labeling technique to study the individual behavior of these small soil plankton in a way that was uh, previously not possible. And uh, we really hope that you enjoy this uh, presentation.